Hello Virgo and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of July 17th. Mm. You know, there could be some indecision this week. Um, it could be related to finances too, because we are seeing some financial symbols here. But I am seeing like there could be some indecisions or there could be some offerings, you know, or choices that you're maybe not know not knowing what to do, where to go from now, from here. Um, there could be things offered to you or information given to you and you just don't know where to go. That's kind of showing up. You know, I'm trying to explain it in a few ways that it's possible. Definitely go with the flow this week, all right? You may have a tedious were um tedious week like work with work or obligations you know some of you are maybe um domestic divas okay so you that is also considered a job so whatever you do most of the day it doesn't always have to be a job and this is a general reading so there could be some tedious obligations or work all right but you know hard work does pay off all right it just could be a little bit overwhelming now, it's interesting because some of you or someone, you know, may meet a new person connected to work, all right, um, through your job, and, and may, it may become a love interest if you're single, okay? Also, there is some unexpected surprise, all right, and it does look more positive. So kind of expect um, surprise, unexpected energy. It's a general reading, but that's what showed up for, you know, as I'm reading here. You know, follow your heart, let your heart guide you or open your heart for some because it's it's really the message is do things with love. OK, and the more you do things with love, that way you will reach your desires quicker. All right. Now, yeah, you've got some responsibilities again, uh, responsibilities. Again, it's showing up, you know, a lot on your plate that you may take, you know, it may take you down this week. You may be. You know, just say you're always working and, you know, you're a responsible person. You get things done, but you just may not feel like doing it or there's just too much this week. Um, but also, it's a way for some of you, you got to get things done because it's a way of clearing away things, okay, for great things to come. That's another message that's showing up here, all right? You know, you also may realize an ambition you hoped and held for a while now. It is connected to the matters of the heart, so it's really something you've been wanting. So that is showing up. Some things from the past may be coming back. Situations, an old situation may resurface. People from the past may be coming back. Exes, people you haven't seen for a while. That is coming in. I don't know if it's this week, but it is coming in. All right, now, there could be maybe some missed opportunities that was from the past coming into because you do have a horseshoe here, which will denote, you know, some luck is coming in too. So that's another thing. And or, you know, maybe it was a relationship or, or someone you met in the past and it was a missed opportunity. You didn't make the moves. They didn't make the moves. They went away and now you may reconnect. That's another way I'm seeing this can happen. You also have like a dolphin's head. This is a really good energy. So this is really some good stuff coming in um heartfelt communication too for some you know others particularly that are close to you it's like they want respect from you not money not um material things it's respect i'm feeling here there's something that they want from you more than that so really be careful not to criticize it can turn away some people close to you and it can create long-term consequences all right now money can be tight watch your spending or recent spending has caught up with you okay also for some a second source of income or or flow of um second source can cease um, if you're dependent on someone for money, it could be either become restrictive, and I'm, I am seeing that energy here too. It's very interesting. Um, or it can, yeah, end 
or become restrictive. You may be in a group of people. There is a social type of atmosphere showing up. Um, again, communicate well. It's very important to communicate from the heart kindly and nicely this week. Um, communication is very important this week, okay? All right, the plate. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. You can be very sharp-tongued, okay? It is showing up here, too. You can be so sharp or even spiteful, especially with your words, all right? Even actions it can cut like a knife because I'm just seeing that, and it's really going to cause some calm, serious consequences. So if you used to um, criticizing someone, even your, just say your partner, um, your spouse, whoever it is that's close to you, and, you know, they've taken it for years or, you know, and you got used to it. Well, there is going to be some consequences. Some t um, people or a particular person, these are people close to you, could start turning on you. And I, it's it forewarned is forearmed. Again, do everything with love this week. And communication is very important. All right. Um, yes, there is a heavy workload, all right, this week. Again, we're seeing heavy energy, heavy work, um, lots of work, um, getting things done, and it is kind of making you crabby. <laughs> now here, think before you speak again, okay, because there could be consequences, and some, this may have already been happened. There's some, there could have been some consequences already, all right, and that's just going to resurface. Um... Again, it's really telling you to um, do everything with kindness, understanding, okay? Communications are very important this week. Now, as I was saying, watch your money. It's like easy come, easy go. For some, yes, and money could be coming in too. But watch again. You got this around here. Watch the spending again. So it's like easy come but easy go. So money could be coming in, but then watch the spending too. That is a warning. Again, now if you're like living with your parents or you're dependent on a partner for money, maybe they don't, uh, they restrict the funds to you or something like that can be happening too. Or you, they give you money and you're spending it and then they're like, okay, well, I ain't going to give you any more for now. You know, I'm just giving you some examples. All right. So again, communications, be very careful. You do have this, um, breakdown energy you know it could turn into a turn of events and cause here's a triangle consequences in the future well anyway um uh virgo that was your reading for the week ahead of july 17th yes i did think there i hope you have a wonderful week and i'll catch you back next week for your next coffee cup reading until then all the best and bye for now